நமஸ்காரம் ரமாய் ஏகாதசி ஸ்டோரி அண்ட் இட்ஸ் பெனிஃபிட்ஸ் பிஃபோர் சீயிங் தேட் லெட் சி வாட் இஸ் ஏகாதசி ஏகாதசி மீன்ஸ் நம்பர் லெவன் இன் சான்ஸ்கிரீட் இட் இஸ் அ ஃபாஸ்டிங் டே டிவோட்டட் டு லார்ட் விஷ்ணு திஸ் டே இஸ் வைட்லி ஃபாலோட் பை டிவோட்டீஸ் ஆன் லெவன்த் டே ஆஃப் வேக்சிங் மூன் ஃபேஸ் ஆர் சுக்ல பக்ஷா சிமிலர்லி இன் வேனிங் மூன் ஃபேஸ் ஆர் கிருஷ்ண பக்ஷா ஆஸ் பர் ஹிண்டு லூனார் கேலண்டர் so the ekadasi occurs twice a month therefore it comes 24 times a year during leap year it comes around 25 times a year devotees observe this ekadasi fasting to show their devotion and to get liberation from sins and attain moksha devotees can follow full fasting without eating food or drinking water partial fasting with water or eating fruits avoiding grains devotees who cannot observe fasting can recite lord names on this day now let's see about rama ekadasi rama ekadasi is one of the important ekadasi fasting in hindu calendar it falls on krishna paksha of kartik month in english calendar it comes between october and november Rama Ekadasi comes after the Papan Kusha Ekadasi and is followed by Prabodhini Ekadasi. This Ekadasi falls 4 days before the celebration of Diwali, the festival of lights. This Ekadasi also called as Ramba Ekadasi or Kartik Krishna Ekadasi. This Ekadasi washes away the sins by keeping a fasting on this day. Rama is another name for Goddess Lakshmi. On this auspicious day, devotees offer prayers to Lakshmi along with Lord Vishnu to seek the blessings of prosperity, health and happiness. The story and significance of Rama Ekadasi is mentioned in Brahmavai Vartha Purana. The story was narrated by Lord Krishna to King Yudhishthira. Now let's see the story. Once there lived a king named Muchukun he was a sincere and great devotee of Lord Vishnu he strictly and sincerely follow ekadasi fasting he also make sure that all people in his kingdom follows ekadasi fasting because of the effect of ekadasi fasting all the people in the kingdom lived happily and peacefully muchukun had a daughter named chandrabaga He got his daughter married to a handsome prince named Shoban and he was a son of Chandrasena. One day Chandrabaga and his husband Shoban came to her father's place. That day was Ekadasi day. As per the king everyone should follow Ekadasi fasting. Shoban told his wife that he cannot stay hungry. Chandrabaga replied that her father was very strict. humans and even animals follow fasting on this ekadasi day shoban also did the fasting shoban was a prince and he had never been without food his health was not cooperating and was dead by the next day morning because of hunger by virtue of rama ekadasi shoban became the king of the kingdom of mantrachal mountain one day a brahmin named soma varma visited the king shoban and recognized him shoban asked the brahmin to help him make this kingdom and life permanent soma varma returned to chandrabaga and narrated the story he told that the kingdom was result of observing rama ekadasi to make that permanent the virtue that was collected by observing ekadasi fasting for a whole life has to be given chandrabaga immediately replied that she has been observing this ekadasi fasting since 8 years old she is ready to give that virtue to her husband she gave all the virtue to her husband shoban and the life became permanent shoban and his wife chandrabaga ruled the kingdom for long time and lived happily now let's see the benefits of observing rama ekadasi one who observes this fasting on this day may get rid of their past sins present sins and wrong deeds a person worshiping lord vishnu 
with a pure heart achieve salvation this ekadashi fasting will give happiness healthiness good fortune and success in life observing this ekadashi fasting is equivalent to more than 100 rajasuya yagnas or 1000 ashwamedha yagnas devotees will get positive results in life lord vishnu protects devotees from evil forces and hidden enemies devotees overcome all obstacles in life and achieve immense success a person who hear the glory of rama ekadashi will attain salvation and reach the abode of lord vishnu devotees go to lord vishnu temples and perform puja on this day they recite vishnu sakasranamam and vishnu mantras on this auspicious day we also observe this rama ekadashi to seek the blessings of lord vishnu om namo bhagavate vasudevaya